Hello. I'm Simon Cohen, and my family and I will be your hosts for the Jewish Holidays Video Guide. Now, I'll be telling you about the program in a moment, but first, I'd like you to meet my co-hosts. Hi, I'm David. I'm eight years old, and I'm in the third grade. Shalom, I'm Elizabeth, and I'm 12. I've been taking some of the pictures we'll be showing you. I'm Dinah Weiss Cohen. We'd like to thank... No Jew should be alone on Passover, and it is a mitzvah. It's a marvelous deed to be able to invite somebody to your home who hasn't got family. And people did that for me, as I did later on for others. Sometimes we have the youngest child do all the questions, and sometimes we have them share. We try to keep them all involved. Occasionally we go to an adult Seder where each of us must bring a new question, and then we talk about them. In a way, the questions are more important than the answers. On all the other nights, we eat bread, but on the night of Pesach, we eat only matzah. I need your help to begin answering the questions, David. Gimel, I get it all! The game's really easy. You take turns spinning, and before you spin, each person puts a piece of candy or a coin or whatever you're using into the pot. If you get a nun, nothing happens. If you get a gimel, you win the whole pile. If you get a hay, you get half. If you get a sheen, you put in half of what you got. The letters go nun, gimel, hay, sheen. My Hebrew school teacher says that they stand for Hebrew words, nes gadol haya sham, which means a great miracle happened there. Hanukkah has become a very important holiday in our country, and I think we all know why. It's because of the overwhelming presence of a certain Christian holiday at this time of year. 